what's in the box? Welcome to Nolagent. Let the good times roll. All right, I'm excited. I think we have some wonderful items. Oh, 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 oh. oh my gosh, some more amazing dead sled coffee. Michael Berryman, the hills have eyes. Oh, this is a spooky one. Oh my gosh. Ah, single origin Guatemalan. Ooh, it's on the French spectrum. Ooh. Next we have Bill Mosley coffee is my life. Single origin Peruvian. Oh yes. Very wonderful looking. And then oh Vampira, another horror movie one. Vampira, Viva Vampira coffee, 100% oh, Oaxaca Mexican coffee. Oh, these look very nice. And you know, I'm kind of dressed up like a vampire tonight because I'm on my way to a Mardi Gras ball. So let's start out sampling some of the Vampira to keep me going late into the night because these Monte Gras balls uh, involve a lot of late night action. So let's see what happens when I get a little vampire on my side. So for full disclosure, Dead Sled Coffee sends me their wonderful coffees for free to sample and review. All the Dead Sled Coffees have a wonderful rating system where they go from bright down to bitter and the vampire here hits right at full city. We're gonna sample each coffee two ways. I just sampled this one straight up black and now I'm pouring a second serving to add whole milk to that will be the second tasting we'll do. All right, we've got the Vampire coffee. 100% Oaxaca Mexican, which I just tasted some of it straight up black and I just added a little milk to it. Let's give it a sip and see. Ah, uh, yes, yeah, so it really changes characteristics from going to milk from the all black. I love Dead Sled Coffee, how the flavors just really change when you go from the all black to mixing it with different things such as milk, whiskey, rum, and other accessorized items. So uh, certainly it's really smooth with milk. It was very nice uh, black as well. Um, I like it both ways. I mean, it's just incredibly smooth. Uh, that's a very consistent thing I find with a lot of the Dead Sled coffees is they just are incredibly smooth, easy drinking coffees. They're just all such great quality. I uh, really do enjoy them. They're fantastic great quality coffees that really give you some pleasant smells. I mean, it's just such a great coffee aroma here and it's just really got some, uh, mm, just uh, its own little special coffee spectrum of deliciousness here. So I'm liking it and uh, this is gonna come in really handy tonight because the Mardi Gras ball is going to involve quite a few adult beverages later. We're going to have a good time. So, cheers to Vampire and happy carnival to all y'all out there. And let's drink more coffee because, hey, it keeps the fun going. Stay tuned. We're going to test some of these uh, other coffees sooner than later because we're definitely going to need them during the carnival Mardi Gras season. This is just the beginning. We have a whole like month plus more of this to go. So cheers. Oh, wow, so good. Next up, we're gonna sample the Bill Mosley Coffee is My Life. 
And on the rating scale, it's going to hit right at full city. So let's go ahead and pour a sample and get started with another delicious dead sled coffee. Ooh, it smells so good. I can't wait to sample it. <laughs> coffee time again. So we've got Bill Mosley coffee is my life blend. Oh, oh, oh. This is a uh, single origin Peruvian coffee. I'm kind of excited. It's uh, on the full city spectrum here on uh, Dead Sled's very convenient rating scale. They've got a really great rating scale here. All right, let's see how this delicious whole bean, I had to grind it, Peruvian coffee is. This thing was sealed super awesomely air tight vacuum sealed this is the hardest package yet to open from dead sled i've had so this stuff's got to be super super fresh i would think so let's try this uh little peruvian here ah hmm mm. oh, 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 oh well, here we go i'm already uh or uh calm and sedate now a little peruvian coffee This is the first coffee of the day for me. Mm. Oh yes. It's uh, very nice, very smooth. Um, got a little taste of sort of the back of my tongue. And uh, it's like, hmm. It's a very interesting uh, sensation kind of flavor that other coffees I've had don't quite have the sensation taste. Give a little flavor here. Ah. Uh, mmm. I almost want to call it a smoky sensation flavor, but it's not quite that. It's a similar thing to like a barbecue smoky flavor, but not it's uh more of like from the roasted coffee bean sensation like i can certainly tell there's a little uh roastedness in there that's got a very pleasant sensation oh ah. so it's definitely warming me up there's a little uh less than warm for new orleans right now it's in the 50s which is pleasant i would say not our normal uh blazing heat ah it's definitely enjoyable it's a pleasant pleasant experience so far hmm i could easily drink a lot more of this it's so easy to take down it's just pleasant in every way it's uh pretty delightful i can say and just such interesting sensations and flavors that are unlike other coffees i've had i don't even know if i have words to describe exactly the uh distinctions that I'm experiencing. This is uh, such a new phenomena for my taste buds. They're kind of confused. Oh. Mm. Wow. Very unique experience so far that I've really enjoyed. So, Bill Mosley, Coffee is My Life is very enjoyable i have to say um, this is unlike any coffee sensation i've had on my tongue before it's very unique and very pleasant um hmm. i mean i've got things going on back in my taste buds of parts of my taste buds i haven't felt fire off before that's something special oh yeah now we're gonna sample the Michael Berryman, the Hills Have Coffee, and on the rating scale, it's all the way down to French, so it's gonna be on the more bitter side. 
There's just a fantastic coffee aroma coming out as I pour this, and I can't wait to give it a sample. Ooh. Okay, I just made a fresh new batch of coffee for my new shipment with the Michael Berryman, The Hills Have Coffee. This is a single origin Guatemalan, and on their helpful coffee skill, it's French, which is just one up from the strongest of Italian. I had to taste it, it's just smelling so good here. Oh, okay, very, very smooth, very nice. Ah, uh, wow, I've really enjoyed all of the coffees in this shipment. They've all been single origin, so we've had uh, Michael Berryman, The Hills Have Coffee from Guatemala. We have the Bill Mosley, Coffee Is My Life, which is from Peru, single origin. And then, Viva Vampire Coffee, which is a 100% Oaxican Mexican coffee, which is also quite wonderful. Oh, so this is a hard, hard choice to decide out of these three, which I like the best. And, uh, Wow, these have all been phenomenal. I have to say I've uh, really enjoyed all of these. Um, if I have to choose what I like, I think it's going to be the Bill Mosley Coffee is My Life. Uh, it's the Peruvian. Now, this was the only whole bean one that I had to grind myself, where the other two were pre-ground. So that alone could have had a bit of impact on the overall flavor characteristics and impact on my taste buds. But overall, I love all of these. They've all just been amazing. And if you told me though I have to choose, it's gonna be the uh, Bill Mosley Coffee Is My Life one just because it does just a little bit extra kick and flavor and aroma and just overall mouthfeel and ooh, so very tasty and delicious. All three of these are just big wetters to me. I love them all. Now, uh, I have to admit, you know, I've also got a little uh, slight preference for my Vampira here, though, too. Uh, just this classic, you know? Just the old classics are always nice. All right, I'm going to drink some more coffee. Oh, now if you love coffee, too, go ahead and destroy that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. Comment below. Let me know what you think about all these wonderful coffees and any ideas you have about uh, what you might think make these coffees so special. And hey, while you're down there, make sure to check out like, my Patreon account as I do work for tips and I appreciate any help with that. And mmm, wish y'all could join me for a little uh, coffee enjoyment here. Ooh, so nice. If you want to try any of the Dead Sled coffees, just visit their website at deadsledcoffee.com and they've given me a 20% discount code for you, which is N-O-L-A, NOLA. So, if you could share this video with any of your friends or contacts and also enjoy coffee, it really would help me with the YouTube algorithm. And tune in next time for more good food, good times, and good people. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. And if you would just click on the little circle here with a picture of my head in there and subscribe to the Nolajet channel, it would really help me a lot. I really appreciate it. Thank you.